What's up guys, Ultimate King slash Ultra Atomic giving you some Battlefield 4 gameplay. Now guys, you guys are probably wondering, is this finally the review of the Bulldog Assault Rifle? And the answer is yes. Yes, you guys are excited. I'm excited. Let's bring on this review. Now guys, I am going to be comparing this gun with the Scar H. So keep in mind, this gun was under a uh, question that this was supposed to be replacing the Scar H and the and the question that everyone is wanting to know does this actually d replace the Scar H and in my personal opinion it does not the Scar H still remains to be champion on close quarters and medium range now of course guys I'm gonna be doing this review on single shot fire because I honestly do not like a 21 round clip uh, and it just runs out so quick and I feel like I'm more conservative with each shot I throw so let's get started obviously the Bulldog as I noticed I did also try this on full automatic and it actually does really well on full automatic but as soon as you flip that single shot fire and you need to shoot from a ranged position, it doesn't do what it needs to do. It starts recoiling a lot. Now guys, the specs on this Bulldog is pretty much, um, I do have, I believe, angle grip with a heavy barrel and a holographic sight and a laser sight. Now, um, Everyone's probably asking, well, why didn't you put muzzle brake and, you know, stuff like that. Well, I did try it with muzzle brake, but the thing is, is that the problem is with this gun is that it performs differently like the Scar H. It still has a huge recoil and it, it just, it's not as good. I did try it with the same loadout as the Scar H and it doesn't perform well I just get tons of hit markers it, it's still the result is still the same tons of hit markers from across the map it just does not do what you want it to do now what I'm seeing for this as you can tell everyone wants to know well if it performs so good in close quarters I mean isn't it a close quarters map it even fails a little bit in close quarters and I'm gonna tell you why the reload the reload is what kills this gun as you can tell the reload just by itself when you just want to reload but there it is again the reload this is a close quarters map this is what can kill or break the gun the reload when the enemy's coming in you're reloading your gun and he sees you and you want the fastest reload as possible so you can take him down first with the scar h it performs good in long range to medium range and close quarters and the reload is perfect it's basically the strongest assault rifle and the most outperformed in every division of um, the Bulldog. Uh, basically, right now, the Bulldog is pretty much a bull shit. <laughs> so, if you guys get that gun, I mean, obviously, I find it me getting that gun it seems that i just kind of want to get it because of a personal preference i mean it does look different from other guns uh, other assault rifles that i've uh, had and uh, it, it kind of spikes your interest but it performs so sad compared to the scar h the scar h still dominates in single shot fully automatic and it just it kills it it kills it um Pretty much, if I have to review the Bulldog, I will pretty much give it a 2, ladies and gentlemen. A 2. Guys, this will be the end of my review. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, and don't forget to kick that like button on your way out. And for more of your reviews, anything game related, don't forget to kick subscribe button. Ultimate King slash Ultra Atomic out.